Shalom and welcome to Two Minutes of Torah. And this year is in Dialogue Rav Hirsch and Shiduchim, pre arranged marriage. The end of Pashat Chayisar talks about the fact that Yitzhak married Rivka and then he loved her. So Rav Hirsch says that's how it goes. You go ahead, you marry, you get to know the person more and more and more, and then you have true love. But he also has a beautiful line about Shiduchim. What does he say? He says, how is a true marriage, which results in real love, arranged? He writes, <clears throat> Loa, you saw that true not just based on fantasy and attraction. No. Ella al pishikul hatvuna. It's weighed out, it's thought through. Horim ukrovim. Parents, relatives, loved ones, nimlachim batsman, discuss together. It's this young man, young woman. Is this an appropriate match? Do they have similar personalities, aspirations, goals? Similar ideas on modesty, or spirituality, or halacha. With that kind of shidduch situation, where the adults are thinking it through, and it's not some impulsive decision, that's when love will really grow. Kahoshe Marvin, those as more they get to know each other. So isn't that fascinating? A verse is saying when you have the adults without the raw emotions and instincts, they're thinking it through, then you could come into Shidduch where they really love each other. Gemara talks about meeting on some level before and to see each other, of course. And different groups have different amounts, Hasidish world, Yeshivish world, different practices about how much they'll get to meet each other, see each other before. But first, make sure the same values and goals and aspirations. And that's the Shidduch system that Rav Hirsch is alluding to at the end of Hashem Shalom.